Alright, what's up guys, it's Needle, and today I'm going to be making my glorious return to a PHP object-oriented programming tutorials. And yeah, today we're going to be going over extending your classes, and what kind of things you can do with the extends keyword in object-oriented PHP. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. I'm going to make a class in my PHP script, and I'm going to call it dog. And yeah, this is just going to be a basic blueprint if that would be the right word. it's gonna, Our dog class is going to be like a blueprint and it's just going to have things that all dogs do. And so we're going to make a function and call it bark because that's something all dogs do I guess. And we'll make it print out some text like woof woof. Okay. And what else do dogs do? We'll make a function called eat ear I'm retarded. Okay. Uh, eight. We'll make a printout. I am eighteen. Oh yeah, and sorry in advance if the sound quality is kind of shitty. I have to use this really terrible mic, and it's pretty bad. But yeah. So there's our dog class. And if you don't understand what we've done so far, uh, you can check out my other tutorials. They're pretty uh, well explained on all this stuff, I think. So yeah. And now we're gonna make a second class and I'm going to call this one Dalmatian which is a type of dog and now to extend our class after the class name you just use the keyword extends and then the class that you want to you want it to extend from so I want Dalmatian to extend from our dog class so we'll have it extending from dog and yeah what this, what this extends if I could talk properly, what this extends keyword does is take everything from our dog class and puts it into our Dalmatian class. So uh, all these functions are now accessible from Dalmatian, Bark, Eat. Our Dalmatian can do all that. But then we can assign it also like uh, specific ones just for Dalmatian. Like we can give it a function. Uh, um, fight, I guess. Oh. <laughs> can't really think of anything, I'm kind of doing this on the fly, so, yeah. I am fighting. And, yeah, there you go. That's our Dalmatian class, extending from our dog class. And, I'll make another class and call it Labrador. Extends from our dog class, because it's a dog. And, we're going to give it the property color. We're going to make it black. So now we have a black Labrador. So if I save this, people would stop IMing me, damn it. And actually, let's show this actually working. Let's make a new instance of a Dalmatian. Equals new Dalmatian. Ah, itch. <laughs> okay, sorry about that. And <laughs> we'll make a Labrador instance. And we'll set that to equal new Labrador. Now if we try to echo out, say, Labrador color, we should be able to, I think, if I refresh this, and yeah, it prints out black, like it was supposed to, because Labrador has the color black. But what if we try to make our Labrador bark? You see, there is no bark function here in our Labrador class. But if we save and refresh, our Labrador will bark because it's, it's extending from the dog class, which has the bark function in it. So everything in the dog class is automatically carried over to our Labrador class because that's where it's extending from, if you understand. Uh, but yeah, there are loads of uses for this. You can take like um, built-in kind of PHP classes and you can extend those and add in functions of your own for whatever use that may serve. Like, I know there's one class that I used to use called MySQLI, and it was a object-oriented uh, MySQL kind of class that was already installed on this uh, server I have here. And, yeah, I was able to extend it and add in my own functions and stuff that weren't there, like, weren't there by default. So, yeah, it's pretty useful. Uh, you can make your blueprint classes and then make, like, slightly different classes using the extends function or extends keyword 
and yeah I urge you all to use it because it's pretty awesome to be honest so yeah thanks for watching uh, subscribe rate comment send me a message if you don't understand and yeah I'll get around to answering anything you might need help with ASAP thanks for watching see ya